guys what's up it's naomi the crafty savage and i'm back with some unboxings and unbaggings so we'll get into this one first Let's whip out my handy dandy meat cleaver here so i ordered this off of amazon quite a while ago as you guys know i kind of caught that crocheting bug and yeah so i saw this now i have gotten more of these but you know i ordered this one separately because yeah i know it's just how i roll so what did i get i got a sticker right it's a crochet light hook right look at that crochet away even in the dark mm -hmm. look at that Ain't that just nifty difty? So, you know, if you're working on a dark color or, you know, you're working somewhere where the lighting's not as good, go out and get yourself one of these crochet light hooks. I promise they make a world of difference, make it so much easier to see what you're doing. I highly recommend it. Now, this beauty. So... This comes to us from a store over on Etsy. My poor little heart was broken because honestly, I didn't think they were coming back. Like I had gotten so much stuff from them prior and it was just like for a long time, their shop was on vacation. So I think they are back up and running, which made my little heart like just as happy as can be because I love, 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 love this pen company. Their pens are like amazing. The detail they put into it with the sanding, it makes their pens shinier than any other pen makers I have ever seen. And this is why they are one of my favorite pen companies so when i got the, the notification on etsy i was like what stop the bus girlfriend i need to get off and get me one of them so enough of me chit chatting you probably want to know where it's from it is from none other than chroma art design pens and believe me i have a lot of them but that don't stop me from ordering more mm -mm. so what did i get they always have it nice and packaged beautifully here is my invoice it says thank you very much eric and bren so ooh, look at this nice little card it's got their chroma diamond art pen Bren and Eric Herr, handcrafted in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I probably botched that up. Chroma Pens appreciates your support of our small business. We have worked hard to handcraft a quality product that we hope you will enjoy to use for the years to come. You can replace the tips by using the pliers to gently pull out the press fitted tips. The tips are the standard size from the pens you receive in your panning kit. Sometimes new tips are smaller in di diameter and can you can wrap a piece of scotch tape around them around the end before pr press fitting into pen. If I could talk, right? It says, follow us for updates over on Instagram. What? They're on Facebook too? Mm, I need to go check them out. Chroma Diamond Art Pens over on Etsy. It looks like they got a website, w.chromapens.com. Oh my God, they're just out here doing everything and they did not tell me. I tell you, what am I going to do with them? I'm just going to have to buy them all, right? No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I, I mean, I, I might I might leave one for y'all and you guys can fight over it, right? Comes with their awesome Chroma Diamond Art Pen. As you can see, I have one on my table right here. Alrighty, so what else? Ooh, they threw in some sweet tarts. We got the strawberry Laffy Taffy. Okay, so let's see. What 
did I get? What is this? Beauty's Miss Handmade with Love. Mm -hmm. Hey, what is it? Dun, 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 dun. They're surprising y'all. Look at them. Like I said, Chroma Pens, they always make sure, oh my gosh, that it, between the box and the wrapping and just, it's always so nicely protected. But look at this. Oh, good golly, Miss Molly. I have died and gone to diamond painting pen heaven. Oh my gosh, I wish you guys could see how shiny this is because the camera is doing it no justice. This one is called Lucid Clouds. I love how it kind of like almost like reminds me of like the beach or like the sunset, like how it changes colors and goes into each other. It comes with a single placer and you have your choice. I always like the four, the thin four placer because that's just like my go-to for multi-placing. They give you the option. You can pick, you know, whatever um, t other tip you want at the end besides, you know, the single placer. But yes, oh my God, I need to go diamond painting. Fill this bad boy up with wax and get to it. But oh God, if you haven't gone and checked out Chroma Diamond Art Pens, do it. I will tell you, they sell out fast though, because when I say like their pens are gorgeous, shiny, like you have to be quick with them fingers. All right. Like just quick. So I will make sure to have everything linked down in the description box below. If you're new to the channel and you haven't already hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye!